Every Texan has their own story about what Texas means to them. Our stories are as big and inspiring as the state itself. We work hard and we dream big. We're risk takers and entrepreneurs, from the wildcatters who built the American oil and gas industry to the ranchers and farmers who've worked this hard land. We're leaders and builders and doers, and we don't back down from a challenge. I suppose that's why, to me, Texas has always been a place of tremendous optimism and endless opportunity. It's a place that's allowed so many of us to achieve things we thought we could only dream. My mom started out, like many folks do, in a very tough spot. She was raised by a single mother with a sixth grade education. She married young and by 19 was divorced and raising me as a single mother. You know how they say everything's bigger in Texas? Well, that certainly wasn't the case for the trailer we lived in. She could have buckled under, but instead she buckled down and enrolled into community college graduated from TCU while raising my sister and me. She got herself into Harvard Law School, became a very successful business person, was elected to the Fort Worth City Council, and then the State Senate. That's why public service is so important to me, to help assure that success and opportunity are within reach of every single Texan. I'm Charlotte Burrell. I've been teaching in Texas for 25 years. When the budget was cut, Wendy led her first filibuster. That budget took over $5 billion away from public education. It's leadership like hers that's led to the restoration of much of that money. No one thought that she could succeed, but she gave this generation of Texas students a chance at success. Making education a priority will create good jobs and keep Texas on top. Texas is a great place to do business. I'm Nina Petty, and I've been doing business here for the last 25 years. On the city council, Wendy was a leader. She was a champion for revitalizing our community and creating thousands of good jobs. Wendy knows that a strong business climate creates a brighter future for Texas families. Listening, working together, finding solutions, that's how we should be doing business in Texas. Texas is a tough on crime state. My name's Terry Moore. I've spent the bulk of my time prosecuting violent crimes. Throughout the state of Texas, there were thousands of rape kits that were untested. It was like nobody cared. Wendy Davis saw the need. By passing legislation, she required all these rape kits to be tested. And by doing so, she gave the police and prosecutors a very powerful tool. It's just common sense. I worked across the aisle to make sure we were doing everything we can to get criminals off our streets. I was extremely proud. I fought for my country and my state. My name's Joe Alviar. I served two tours in Iraq, one tour in Afghanistan. Wendy Davis stood up for veterans when others wouldn't. She ensured that there'd be counseling for the returning veterans, telling us about different job opportunities. What Wendy Davis brought me and my family was security. We were gonna be able to make it once we got out of the Army. Like any true Texan, I've taken on my share of tough fights. Together, I know there's no fight we can't take on and win. Texas made it possible for me to go from that tiny trailer to a successful business and to the Texas Senate. I want every Texan to have those same opportunities. We have so much to be proud of, where we've come from and what we are today. I'm running for governor because I know our best days are yet to come. Join me and together let's make Texas as great as we know it can be.